there's an attorney I know in California who puts on the bottom of his emails, cheap lawyers aren't good and good lawyers aren't cheap. Uh, the answer to the question would be, if you want to have a chance to get the best results in your case and experienced, which usually means more expensive, DUI lawyer is the way to go. Um, there are lawyers out there that will actually send you um, solicitations in the mail to hire them, which is one of the most intrusive things I could think of, letting the people who live at your house Anyone who gets your mail, your letter carrier, the post office, all these people, you know, that are familiar with your name now know that you got arrested for a DUI. Thanks, attorneys. No, don't hire the cheap lawyer. Don't hire the lawyer who sends you these mailers, these, you know, intrusive mailers. That's not necessary. Find someone, and there are a handful of us who are, you know, very, very good, experienced DUI lawyers who operate in Marin County. Um, I'm the only one I know who only does DUI defense. And, uh, you know, find someone that you're comfortable with. Um, we do free consultations. I will do payment plans. I don't know if the others do payment plans or not, but I certainly do. I understand that people don't have, you know, a full fee, um, on hand, um, ready to, to give a lawyer. So I will split it up over a number of months if that's needed. And, uh, you know, you're going to get the best advice that an experienced lawyer who does DUI work exclusively in my case, mainly in some of the other cases, uh, can give you. And it's really, really important to, to have that experience because we're talking about your future driving privilege, criminal record, and so many other things that come into play when we're dealing with a DUI. We're talking travel. We're talking employment. We are talking about um, thing. if you get convicted, depending on what, the, what you get convicted for, um, can be a major roadblock to your future. So it is important to not hire that cheap DUI lawyer who, in many cases, will just plead you guilty right away. Get someone who will fight your case. Get someone who will look at the video in your case, who will review the records and ask for the records on the breath testing machine or machines that devices that were used uh, when you were arrested in Marin County for drunk driving. Or if it's blood testing, you know, make sure you know that you hire a lawyer who actually re requests and reviews the uh, what we call the blood litigation packet, which will have uh, chromatographs, which will show potentially whether there's contamination in the blood testing that was done, and also will get the chain of custody to see um, where the blood went, how long it took to get to the lab to see if it may have sat in a you know warm mailbox or mail truck or you know. FedEx or UPS truck while it was being sent from uh, the Marin County Jail or whatever police agency where the blood draw happened up to Santa Rosa to the Department of Justice. I just saw one of these that it took almost 10 days to get there. This is something that is unexcusable and that can result in, you know, the alcohol level being higher than it was when they drew your blood because you get fermentation going on in these situations. Um, it's just... It's not a good medical practice to have blood that's been drawn sitting in a warm area that gets super warm, especially in the warmer months. Um, good DUI lawyers, great DUI lawyers will look into all of this. The cheap ones usually do not. So there's your answer. And we also do a free consultation.